The story of DJ Cutmaster Rick began as a young child, growing up in Washington, D.C. Introduced to music by his family, listening to hours of music in his Aunt Mary's record collection. The music of James Brown, Stevie Wonder, Aretha Franklin, and so many other soul music artists was always playing at his home. Go-Go music was the new sound of DC in 1976, and Chuck Brown, Trouble Funk, EU and RE, were the early pioneers. But in 1979, a new form of music hit the airwaves by storm. Sugar Hill Gang came with a hip hop, a hippie to the hippie to the hip hip hop, a you don't stop a rocking. And hip hop music on wax was born. But go-go music was still king in D.C., and the only music you heard on radio was pop, rock, and soul. In 1983, a friend named Hunt told Rick about a radio station that was playing hip-hop music. The show was called Breaker's Delight, and the host was DJ Frank Ski and DJ Larry G. And uh, Shorty Rap, Mike Masters, Gigolo Boys, what's up homeboys? M.I. Cruz says, what's up? The Ninja Crew, Keisha Ford, Chuck with a special dedication to Pinky. Cutmaster Rick is checking in a place to be. Also, Dr. Claus is fresh. Playboy Ice is checking in, Ninjas of Landover. Go-Go Fila is checking in, what's up homeboy? Go-Go Steve of the Eastern Groove Crew. Happy birthday to Carr, special happy birthday to Vanessa, also one going out to Boo, Dondi, and G, and a special happy birthday going out to Wanda. Once again, if you'd like to call us up and speak to uh, Z3 before the interview, it's 364-6092, 364-6092, or my personal Red Hot check-in numbers. Coming on next, a special master mix done by yours truly, Frank Ski and Larry G. So hold on tight, get your uh, tape decks ready as we proceed to rock the house funky sound, huh? Oh baby, oh baby, come on. After hanging out at different events with Frank and Larry in 84 and 85, it was at that point when Rick knew he wanted to be a DJ. Before having any equipment of his own, he would go over his friends' houses, like Reggie Taylor and Kevin Seabrook, and break their parents' needles on their record players, while scratching. Rick had boom boxes, and would often fool friends, who thought he was mixing right in front of them, by simulating scratches as the music would play. In 1985, Rick Saint Mary brought him his first turntables and mixer, and the mixtape soon followed. The name DJ Cutmaster Rick was chosen because of his heavy influence by DJ Grandmaster Flash and DJ Jam Master J. Rick picked Cutmaster because at the time, you didn't bite or copy someone else. But then came a record by someone named Cutmaster DC. Rick thought this person had taken his name somehow, since Rick was from DC. So Rick changed the spelling of his name, and added the K to differentiate from Cutmaster DC. In 1986 Rick started making mixtapes, he still has a copy of his very first mixtape. Take a listen. One, two, three! In the place to be. Yeah. You can see, we did Ricky it is what? The real <laughs> jump beat up. Hold, hold up, before we get started. Oh, uh, I'd like to say something about that. What is it? Is hot as hell. Scratch it on the wheels of steel. steel. And his partner. <laughs> On a mission. And you know why? Because. Because. It's my sweetheart. I'm 
kissing because I desire desire. desire. DJ Ricky. Now kiss my throat. The lady never stayed with the big jump beat up. In 1987, Rick and his high school friend, Ernest Dalton, formed a rap group called the Gresham Place Crew. Rick would DJ and make beats, while Erno would rock the mic. Make the money like bucks, run the casino. So why you trying to mug me? I'm DJ Earn, yes I'm back again. You know I got mad friends and I'm people from within. And I ride the max, you know it's me when you see me. In 1989, Rick was introduced to the teachings of the Most Honorable Elijah Muhammad, as taught by his student minister, the Honorable Minister Louis Farrakhan. Hip-hop artists like P.E., Rock Kim, and KRS-One, would be the foundation of what became known as Conscious Rap. In 1993 while in the Nation of Islam, Mosque No. 4, Rick was the DJ in a rap group called Black Hands of Persecution. Rick appeared on a cable TV show called Pump It Up with the group. Now let's have a look at Black Hands of Persecution. I greet you my beloved brothers and sisters with the greeting words of peace in the Arabic language Assalamu Alaikum <laughs> to those of you who are unfamiliar with those words they mean in English peace be unto you Ah uh, yeah, yo, we gonna come off like this. Black hands of persecution, a man on a mission. This is condition. Yo, yo, yo. The scope went and they scoop me out. They eating everything on the pig from the tail to the snout. I go a different route than the cat rat and diggy diggy dog. I scrap to eat boss hog, no so I jog to stay in shape. The boss flow the beat, couldn't bust a grape. We demo tape, put them in second rate. What the yuck says he fake, now they got a date. And a plate break, stick the law eight and a sell out squad. I Mess around with the drink, no word. You go, boss, or you go, 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 buff like Polo. Love and rage and a quit off solo. That I was in cop, Nitro, cop, Diesel. Step into the weasel, it's the Viso, double S. The mic put the fresh. Five men on a mission. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. A man on a mission. Say what, say what, say what? Yo, 
yo, yo. I'm at on a mission. We gon' kick it like this one time for your mind. Check it out. Just dice, just I see quality, just us. Still get sweated, wet, and rust, then turn to dust. Stay down there, what I'm screaming, screaming. Always rise to the top or above emotion to the thinking of God. Not hard, Lord desire. The boss on the side, the king of the empire of the temple. P love, I got the temple, but wait a minute, hold up. Biggie Smalls got the fat, fat tracks, backbones, and microphones. Black like the car. White stone. I'm solid as a rock. If God is keen, then why some use a padlock with a combination left, right, two piece with no biscuit? They was eating like a twisted from a man on a mission. Yo, 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 a man on a mission. A man on a mission. Let's give it up again for Black Hands of Persecution. Yeah. Yeah. In 1995, the DJ came from behind the wheels of steel and got on the mic on Steph Love's show on 93 WKYS. Supremacy, so Stephen Boots, why don't you go ahead and give us our trophy? So what's your name? Master Rick. Where you from? Northwest. I feel you do the spotlights on you. You know that I'm a DJ, not a rapper. Try to bust a mic, don't but because I'm the crew, you know I'm gonna continue to rap. Oh, Rick is in the house, so what time? Special places in the house. Two times, Mr. Rollcall, baby. Oh, Rick's Rose in the house, so what time? Special places in the house. Two times, Mr. Rollcall, baby. Oh, Rick's Rose in the house, so As the years went by, Rick changed with the time and moved on to the digital age in music. In 2002, Rick started DJing with CDs and began phasing out of albums and turntables. In 2010 came the new Mark Mix deck and goodbye to CDs, hello media players. Rick still mixes in his spare time and make mixes for his Ustream, YouTube, and Facebook pages. Yeah, nigga, 